Welcome to day 13 of Shopmas. They have so much Christmas decor in here. Oh my gosh. So definitely check here because I feel like a lot of people don't think shop here. Am I crazy or do they not have ones literally just like this at Target? Hello everyone, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando and I do all shopping and shop with me videos as well as home decor and home decorating. If you love shopping at stores like Target, TJ Maxx, Ulta, World Market, Kirkland's, Home Goods, Joann's. You're definitely going to love it here. I'm doing Shop Miss the entire month of December. Every single day I am posting new videos showing you Christmas decor, shopping for Christmas gifts, and giving gift ideas for everyone in your life. I'm also giving stocking stuffer ideas, showing Christmas crafts. It is so much fun making these videos every single day. So if you love shopping videos, home decor, or if you need gift ideas, please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below so you don't miss all of my future Shop With Me videos. I I am trying to hit 50,000 subscribers by Christmas, so I would love it if you would join my little corner of the internet and hit the subscribe button down below. In today's video, we are shopping at Big Lots. I remember loving their Christmas decor last year, so I'm super excited to get inside and see what they have for 2021. I'm also going to be giving gift ideas and stocking stuffers along the way, so if you are excited to see what they have at Big Lots for Christmas decor of 2021, or if you need some gift ideas or affordable stocking stuffers, then just keep watching because we're gonna head inside right now. They have so much. Christmas decor in here. Oh my gosh. Okay, but I actually want to start right here. This is the Brio Hill collection and it looks so good. This collection uses lots of like deep, deep tones and like really pretty velvets. So they have these trees for 18. They have a red, which I feel like is showing up brighter on camera than it is in person. Then they have this really pretty emerald as well as this is like metal, but it matches these really well. This one is gold, also 18. So unfortunately, right here for the first time ever, my microphone decided to go out. It does kick on later in the video, but I didn't want to just delete all these clips because I still wanted you to see what they had at Big Lots. So they had those really pretty glass trees with the gold on the bottom. I'm so sorry. I'm not going to have the prices for pretty much anything since I lost all of the audio. They also had these really cool star figurals that reminded me a lot of the Studio McGee ones that they had in Target. They're like a little bit different but similar idea. Then if you like to do more like rustic-y cabin vibes, they did have these antler stocking holders, but they were super lightweight. This was really cool. They had these wooden deer that had these like fur, um, oh my gosh, what is that word called? A saddle like almost a fur saddle with leather I really liked the two different sizes of these these are super nice and I haven't seen anything like this at either store the fur was super soft and I just really enjoyed them this I loved it reminded me a lot of the one at the at-home store it is a beaded snowflake garland and then they also had ornaments that matched and then I think yeah they also had a star to match so I like how they had this nice set this sign is so expensive looking I was absolutely in love it's a farm fresh Christmas tree sign which I feel like you can find at lots of stores like Hobby Lobby um, the at-home store stores like that but I've never seen one in all gold like this and I absolutely loved it it's killing me so bad that I don't know the prices of these items but oh my gosh you guys I'm so sorry <laughs> So next up was this aisle, which was a lot more modern decor. So they had these little snowmen that are holding a snowball, super adorable, like gray and white snowmen. Then they had these really fabulous, like blinged out reindeer that had fur on the neck, as well as a little bow and silver antlers. Very modern and expensive looking. These trees, I feel like we've seen at a lot of different stores. If I remember correctly, they were a little bit pricier than they were at other stores, so I would not recommend purchasing purchasing these here I felt like you could get a better deal at a store like home goods so I will say a lot of things seemed like better deals here but there were a couple items that I think were cheaper if you shopped elsewhere they did have a couple different throw pillows for each collection so for this more silvery snowy collection they had this let it snow pillow that was embroidered with ice skates then they had this beaded snowflake pillow that had lots of beads and sequins and it was like a really pretty gray color I feel like these items would go so well with the collection that they had at Joann Fabrics 
course, which was the same, very like icy, snowy, modern, lots of whites and grays. I really, really like it. It's not my personal style of what I have done in my home, not to say that I wouldn't do it in the future, but I like how similar to other stores, Big Lots has a couple different collections, which I will be showing the other ones as well. Here is a really pretty centerpiece. This is super nice. I love the sleigh that it comes in with the snowflakes and I love how it has all like silver elements like poinsettias. I've also figured out I've been saying that wrong for the last 28 years of my life. Also with silver ornaments and then different like pine sprigs coming out, some of them being flocked and I love the fur accents on there as well. Moving on, they did have some bathroom items for this collection. So they had little soap dispensers. They had a fox, which is like a really pretty pearlescent color. I absolutely loved the sheen on it. They also had a tree that had these little pearl balls all over it. Next, they did have this snowman, which was again, very pearlescent. I love how his scarf also has glitter. These were so nice. I love his little let it snow sign and the snowflakes. And next to that, they had a three snowflake soap dispenser. I just thought those were all super beautiful. Moving on, this is a much more like rustic farmhouse e traditional type Christmas collection. I actually have this exact sign from last year so it's fun to see that they have brought a few items back and then also kind of added on to those collections if they were successful last year. I'm guessing that's why they would have done that. So they had a similar sign to that one with a like bead garland going across this top that said peace on earth. Down here they had this magnetic days until Christmas like advent calendar. I truly feel like Christmas of 2021 was the year of advent calendars every store had so many different styles they had magnetic ones they had felt ones they had fabric ones and they actually had this in two different colorways I really really like these honestly I felt like they looked pretty expensive I love the magnetic concept with the wreath I love the fonts that they chose I also like the natural wood colored frames that they came in so I was a big fan of both of these. Moving on they did have a couple of different table signs so they had this one which was also an advent calendar. I loved the black lab in the back. I thought that was a super nice touch. I feel like that could also go well with like coastal decor. I feel like being from Massachusetts I always equate um, like a black lab dog with like preppy coastal things. Maybe that's because of some brands that they have on the Cape and Nantucket. I don't know that's just me. Moving on they did have more wooden reindeer so they had these ones these ones look more like a carved wood and then they actually were like painted they were quite interesting they had several different sizes of them and they were um, I think actually wooden they did have a decent weight to them then they had these burlap trees that were basically wrapped in a twine that had those like tiny little red berries that you can find like wreaths made out of around this time of the year I do feel like these cone burlap wrapped trees or twine wrapped trees would also be a really fun DIY craft for next year just to keep in mind. I loved this joy sign. I actually thought it was so so nice. I just am obsessed with snowflakes. If you've seen a lot of my other Christmas decoration videos you will definitely know that and then I was very surprised to see this Merry Christmas sign because I actually have this as well. It's the exact same sign as last year. The only difference is that the words Merry and Christmas on mine are in black and on this year's version they are red which is a much more traditional Christmas take. Sadly I didn't find anywhere to put that sign in my Christmas decor this year so if I can't find a place for it next year I will be donating it for sure. I loved these plushy reindeer. I loved all the little elements like the embroidered star near its butt as well as the pine with the ribbon and I loved the antlers so I really really liked those. I have gravitated a lot towards plushy items this year and who's surprised another advent calendar this one's not magnetic though it has a little peg for every single day and you just kind of hang the wreath on it and move it to the different days i loved all of the pine and the berries that they had on top i thought that that was a very very nice touch it's a very traditional Christmas item. I really, really like this. I was confused, though, if you're supposed to count down from the bottom or up from the top, if that makes any sense at all. But this is definitely the year of the advent calendars. Here are more glass trees that have clear bottoms. These are 18, so pretty, can match with any accent color you want to do. And then look at these. Am I crazy or do they not have ones literally just like this at Target? 
These are 22. The ones at Target are glass, like solidly, whereas this is like glass panels with metal. So a little bit different, but similar idea. They have some awesome outdoor decorations as well. I really like this ornament yard stake that says Joy. Love that, how it looks like the three ornaments stacked on top of each other. That one's really awesome. They also have this one if you are a big dog lover. Red truck, Christmas tree farm, says Merry Christmas. And then they have lots of like really, really fun wreaths and stuff, super non-traditional but i love seeing all of the rainbow stuff and i also really love these presents i actually need a couple of these for our front door so i actually may go ahead and pick up a couple of these the bigger ones are nine and the smaller ones are seven look at these christmas storage totes this would be a really good place to pick these up i know i'm gonna need several of these for next year like to put my stuff away that i bought this year because i got a lot of new stuff and i just want to pack my stuff better than i had it packed before this one's cool because it's actually on wheels and this is a big storage container also looks mouse resistant so something to keep in mind these huge ones are 32 and then they have some smaller size ones down here that are 20 so they have a lot of different sizes they also have the colored ones which is great to see but i'm weird i like to get the red totes that have like the green lids so i need to keep looking what i love about big lots is like it's a whole store they have a home decor section a food section a furniture section they have like a home section with like pots and pans so many different things like so many great gift ideas like these blankets that are only six dollars they have so many different kinds and colors they have behind me like perfume sets gift sets like these dove body sets make a great gift it's crazy like they have whole sections for like anything you could possibly need i never think to shop here i do do videos here like kind of often but i'm always so amazed when i come here look at all of these christmas canisters for ten dollars all of them are ten they have a santa red truck really adorable snowman this one that just says cookies you could definitely use it all year round they have this dog one that's in a sweater they have this Christmas tree one, which I actually really love. I specifically wanted to look for this because someone told me that they had this here and I really, really like it. It's super cute. Then they have this red one that has like reindeer, more Santas, more snowmen, but these are only $10. That's such a good deal. It's cheaper than you could find something like this at Home Goods for sure. If you have someone that is moving out for the first time, they sell lots of really awesome pots and pans here. They have so many different like brands to choose from, cutlery sets, such a great place to shop for home items. I think I was a weird kid growing up. I've always really been into like home decor and obsessed with my room. I used to paint my room all the time when I was younger. I would ask for Christmas. I'd be like, can we redo my room? And I'd want to paint it and get new furniture. So I feel like this has always been in my blood. So I'm so glad that I like found my way to what I do now, even if it was like kind of a weird path, it all worked out. But at Big Lots, they sell lots of really nice furniture at a super, super, super good price. So I want to show you like a couple beds and stuff in case you maybe have like a teenager or someone in your life that might want like a room makeover for Christmas. This bed is absolutely amazing. It is $4.99. I love the upholstered look of it. They also have this one, which is the upholstered back, but then it has like this very masculine wood around it, which is timeless. I really, really like to have upholstered backing because if you're ever sitting up like reading or working on your computer from bed, it's a lot more comfortable than being up against wood like that. That's just how I feel. And this one is $7.99. It would be $7.99 for a king size. And they always have the furniture that goes with it. So they'll have like matching nightstands and a matching dresser if you want to purchase a full set look at these tiny recliners i always love these whenever i see them these are on sale right now so these are 60 dollars a piece so fun we had these as kids and i love how they have like a cup holder these big comfy chairs are awesome if you have like a dad in your life or a grandpa maybe who needs like an upgrade in his living room this would be a great place to buy one of these they have really good sales going on a lot of these are like 400 or less in the 300s or 200 range and they all look so comfy and what i love is you can buy it and take it out with you today you don't have to worry about going to a furniture store and waiting months for it to come you can literally buy it and take it with you another great thing is that they also price match i think i said this in my last video but i feel like this is a place that people don't really think to come unfortunately which is why i love shopping here and sharing these ideas with you but i did confirm that they do price match so let's say you're looking for a particular vacuum or home appliance 
you may not be able to find it at stores like Target or Walmart. It may be sold out. Check Big Lots because if they have it here, they'll price match to whatever, you know, Black Friday deal or Christmas deal that you find and they will price match it. So definitely check here because I feel like a lot of people don't think to shop here and this is one of those sleeper stores where you can find a really sold out item because no one thought to check here. Just my tip. Alrighty, you guys. Well, that is going to be it for me. I really hope you enjoyed seeing the Big Lots Christmas collection this year. If you did, be sure to let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up and hitting the subscribe button down below to help me reach 50,000 subscribers by Christmas. Please be sure to also let me know what was your favorite item I showed in today's video. I'm so excited to see what you think about their Christmas collection this year. I absolutely loved it. I loved it last year, so I'm not surprised I loved it again this year. But that is going to be it for me. I'll see you tomorrow with another day of Shopmas. Bye, guys.